<laughs> Ahoy, everyone, and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian tonight, along with. Peace, mighty Lieutenant Rakir, at your service. And welcome to, well, one of our new side quest games. And yeah, this is Apotheon. And uh, yeah, as should be a bit obvious, this game has, well, probably the lowest you can go for quote unquote sexual contact. Like, you get to see this stuff in museums without any warnings or such. So I very much doubt anyone except the most extreme broods would be bothered by this. Okay. Yeah, and I mean, if you all can see, it's very heavily inspired by uh, the vase's artwork. Yeah, the, the whole style of how those were painted. And I'd completely forgotten slash overlooked that apparently this game has some sort of multiplayer. Let me take a quick peek. I... I did not know that. Okay. It might, I'm guessing that's for competitive or something. Like, it's something that a lot, quite a few old games have... I mean, that's I'm not sure how old this one is, but it used to be a lot more often that just some minor competitive uh, multiplayer stuff was basically just attached on. But yeah, we're here for something else. So let's start a new oh. game. I have um, a somewhat idea how old this is. Um, how to say this? It was hmm? probably before Yak Septicai hit his first million. <laughs> Maybe. I think it's somewhere from the 2010s or so, and yeah, so it looks like I, the lowest... I know... <laughs> the first time I saw this was from Jacksepticeye. Okay. Uh, yeah, the lowest difficulty that we have is Warrior, then we have Champion, uh, deal for, uh, yeah, plus 50% damage received, 50% faster attack speed, no health recharge gets added on on the Olympians. So let's just start on the lowest difficulty and take a new slot. The gods have abandoned you. What love they once gave is now gone. The sea gives only water. The woods give only wind. The earth gives only dust. Even the midday sky gives only twilight. And with their shepherds gone, the sheep fall prey to wolves. Without the gifts of Olympus, you are lost to the darkness. Uh, yeah, shit's uh, grim. <laughs> okay, can I actually use the controller instead for this? I okay, I can use. Okay, yeah. Or okay, I can look around with the right stick, but it's not actually responding to movement with the left stick. So I guess I can turn this thing back off again. Okay, there. That way. Okay. And yeah, we are someone in a place that is not doing too well. Okay, give me that. This one's okay. Let's grab that as well. Like Andrios. Ungar! The living. Our watchmen didn't even see their ships through the darkness. These raider scum will take everything we have. They're taking prisoners, invading houses, and burning anything they can't pillage. I need you wherever you can stick a blade. Okay, we are Nicandrios. We have a map. Edge. Yep. Okay, we have three places. Why are they doing this? Yep. Uh, let, let's be honest. If these people were any worse off at the moment, then, then they would be. Then they would start raiding in themselves, anyways. Since well, the only resources left are well, whatever any, everyone else has. Nectar of healing. Let me grab that. Or healing, of course. Okay. Find the apothecary. 
Okay. Give me that. Let me put that in our offhand. And I... I... <laughs> There's just plenty that can be said about the uh, art style of this, and they really do it well. Yeah. I think this is the only game I've seen in this all of last time. Like, I think we all seen sketches on comedy and cartoons as such where they'd use this art style for a short moment. But this is definitely the only game I seen that use this art style all the way. Before they could find me. I'm fine, but you look dreadful. Come closer, my boy. Here, let me show you how to mix a soothing tonic for your wounds. Here we go, and we get a little bit of crafting. There, new recipes, Greek fire and nectar of healing. Titanity of Crete. Okay. And we can craft them, well, if we have enough stuff. Like that. Now we have two healing flasks. Oh dear. Okay. If, if there's something I pray we never rediscover is Greek fire. Yeah. Basically the napalm of the ancient world. Yeah, and might be more powerful. Since Hello. if you throw water at it, it just gets worse. Okay. Now, with the combat, how we attack with weapons depends a bit on how we move. Like, if we move the mouse upwards, we do an upward slash. If we hold still, it's a stab. And yeah, it, it does cost some stamina, as you can see in the lower left. But that doesn't make this a Dark Souls game or anything like that. <laughs> Another swords. We can only carry a few, I believe. Or only one at the moment, maybe. Um, actually, okay, we've got a torch. Uh, yeah, we have a limited amount that we can carry. We'll always have our fists. But they will eventually, or most will eventually break, I believe. Okay, this is just the lecturing room, the basement. What wonder? Who the heck is the guy with the discus? I believe that's just supposed to be a more general show of uh, an Olympian. Sacrificial yeah, oil. Yeah, but I feel like I've seen that specific pose and figure, a statue and painting, so many times that I wonder, is it supposed to be someone special or what? <laughs> I wouldn't know. I, I got a few books about Greek mythology, but I haven't read them in a while. And plus, there's just so freaking much with Greek mythology as well. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Help me over here. Uh, okay, don't attack the ones with blue, though I don't think we can hurt them even if we wanted to. I thought you accidentally stabbed him first. Shut up, you. Don't know if there's a limit to how many of the healing items we can carry around. Or the... Or the... Uh, mate crafting materials. Oh, also, just... Armor drink. fork. And... A shield, maybe? Oh, wait, no, mm. that's a crate. It's, okay, seems like we can't carry... Maybe we can only carry one of each type at a time or so. Either way. To the blacksmith. Okay. Fancy house. <laughs> okay. Yep, yep. Yeah, slingers. <laughs> okay. Spears, of course, yeah. more reach. But we'll also be ew, more. <laughs> the heck was that? I, I think we just got hit with the great fire or something. I think he just threw a slingshot at a vase that blew up. Okay, and we can only carry 10 of these, from the looks of it. Okay, give me that. And then I'll just drink one. Okay, that's sealed, so no going that way. Oop. Why are you standing there in nothing but your skin? <laughs> that thick skull of yours as good as a helmet. I think I got some old leathers in the back you can wear. Grab me that coin box, would you? 
I want to make sure you can cover the costs. <laughs> Yo, come on. <laughs> I think we have something better to, de to think yeah, on now. Try these on. Cover up that greasy hide of yours. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's see. Yeah, we can get armor by quote unquote upgrading through to it. So we can get some linen bracers, a little cap, some black wraps, and a little thorax. And there we go. We look a bit more presentable. <laughs> Yeah, linen, if I remember right, linen thorax is the linen armor that yep. is on your chest. And we can get some armor over here. If we go over a certain amount, it will start to drain on its own. Also, let me grab that. Okay. And yeah, we can just destroy some more stuff. For more Wait, stuff for ourselves. On. Hmm? Why does the blacksmith have a bloody damn ballista in his workshop? <laughs> Why not? Because he's likely needs yeah, he's likely the one who needs to make the bolts and such for that, or at least the, the heads for it. Uh, the... Okay, now you now you just have a grudge against him. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, open that up. There we go. I don't think there's something like directional damage. Like if we hit someone in the head, it doesn't deal any more damage than if we hit them in the torso. But it has been a it has been quite a while since I played this game. They're taking the grain. God stop them. We don't even have enough to last the season. Okay. Give it up. No, nope, you give it up. <laughs> okay. And that was the spear breaking. There we go. Ow. Okay. Time for the platforming. Okay, we can look around further with shifts. I didn't remember that at all. Typically, shift is more for running. Okay. Still a nice option, still. Get him. There we go, give me that. <laughs> Extra armor again. Yeah, as, as we upgrade our armor, I'm pretty sure that the amount over there will get expanded to a further maximum. Oop, climb. Okay. More armor. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah the, the game is pretty easy so far, but that's because, well, we're in the first... Oh, come on. We're in the first part of it, so of course it's going to be going a bit easier on us. Yeah. Give me that. And yeah, all of the damage there got absorbed. Got absorbed by the, the armor. We can't take that pitchfork. Okay. Okay, we can have multiple daggers, it seems. Hmm. Okay. Release prisoners and find the hunter. Let me... How many of these can we have? Quite a few, it seems. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, enemies will get really jumpy at points. Give me that. And there. Okay. Bonk. Run you through, you mean. Bonk. <laughs> okay, this club is dealing quite a bit of damage, actually. Okay, does it actually... Let's see, inventory, uh, weapons, 20 damage, 15 damage, 15 damage, 50 extra to shield, 10 damage max, okay, and then just base <laughs> 5 damage. I would love if you somehow could drop your fist for inventory. <laughs> I think there have been games where they have, that have allowed you to do that. 
and typically not intentionally at least. Yeah, but that looks like a big oversight when that happens. <laughs> Don't be scared. Lay those weapons down. Shut up, you. Lock picks. There we go. Yeah, with lock picks we can open up locked doors, other than doors that require specific keys. Oh, roll. I completely forgot about that. So, yeah, just, we can pick this lock. Right. And yeah, enemies can use key. No, not keys. Can use shields as well. So yeah, we need to we need to find a way around them or just break them. Okay. Open this up. And let's see. Sagaris, powerful and heavy axe, capable of cleaving a man in two. Okay, we're saving that. And linen wraps, plus six armor. And yeah, that got upgraded from 29 to 35. Okay. Nice. Okay. And now to find the hunter. Over here. And yeah, enemies will respawn in places, I believe. Not that these have any wits about them. Oh dear. Yeah, not many know this, but the linen armor that I think Hina is wearing on his chest movement, Spartans loved it for... It was actually a good armor, and easy to mass produce. Yeah, and if you make drums. it thick enough, it'll still stop something, and it would be very light to walk around in. Oh yeah. So, Spartans were not running around shirtless or in bronze armor, but well, some did, but... That uh, uh, linen armor was ex very popular quick for, again, mass production. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Ori runs house. Okay, just smash everything I fat <laughs> Okay, I don't know if it's... Oop, javelins, I'll take those. I don't know if it's mostly from hitting the walls or such, or just using it and hitting things in general that makes uh, dam... That, that gives... Uh, that, that causes weapons to get damaged. Okay, we have hatchets and javelins. So... There we go. Let's break everything we can to, for, to, cry, to try and get as many resources as we can. Yeah. Hunting arrows, I'll take those. I, I went hunting yesterday. Didn't see a single, a single deer. Went out this morning. Didn't see any rabbits. No birds singing neither. There was always the bird songs in the mornings. Peep, sheep, sheep, tweet. Lots of rats, though. People like rat meat, right? I hear them bandits upstairs. Don't you worry. I'll keep all the rat meat safe. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll keep the wine safe, too. Yeah, saving your gut, you mean. Oh, <laughs> dear. Artemis <laughs> must be mad at us. Okay. Well, someone's doing at least a good job with voice acting, and yeah, a, a hunter with nothing to hunt, uh, yeah, they would grab the alcohol. <laughs> I should have got livelihood. Okay, defeat the tyrants. Okay. I can hear you. There we go. Okay. Yep. Something else attacking. Yep. Doesn't matter. There's a father. We need to get. Well, we need to cut off the head of the snake. 
Okay. Combat can be a bit awkward in places. Especially with how you can walk through your enemies. Sit still, you there. Okay, Temple of Dion. Let's deal with this jackass. Okay. And uh -oh. there. Wait, wait. Just boom? No. Yep. Set the place, place on fire? There we go. Okay. Give me some armor. And we're full on what we can carry of that, it seems. That seems to be then... Yep, max inventory of 10. Okay. So 10 seems to be a maximum of things that we can carry outside of arrows and such. There. Stones. Okay. And yeah. Just cue to switch between our offhand weapons. Let's see. Did, you? Did not expect just a raider to come rolling in out of nowhere. Okay, that cost us our, yeah, that cost us our armor. But not much health. It's like this. I should have expected that if they give us a, a shield. Sit still you. And yeah, this can also get rather annoying when they start jumping around like madmen. But you know what? The Fuck you. The man. <laughs> okay, and we can see how much something is damaged by the cracks on the <clears throat> on the icon. So this thing is it. This yeah, this thing is going to break pretty soon. Yep. It's an axe. Don't cheat. Don't, don't burn yourself now. Let's swap it out. Yep. There we go. Two more javelins. Okay. Oh, yeah, let's heal up. Quickly. We do regenerate some health, it looks like, but not. <laughs> it's not like it refill completely God on its own. Save us! They sealed the door behind them, but I have the spare key. Take it! Take it! Give me that. Okay. Actually, let me grab that. It seems like we can carry more. Yeah, one of most weapon types. So it is probably it is a good idea to just grab new ones when possible. Yep. To swap out for a more a less damaged one. There you go, break that shield. Okay. And it looks like the pole arms don't really da <clears throat> have a. They reach farther, but they also can't hit things that are too close. Looks like. Okay. That kind of makes sense. You're not cut the in one with the shaft. <laughs> don't take that out of context. You know what I mean. <laughs> okay. Yeah. 
And yeah, bigger shields, bigger block areas. Okay. Just grab everything I can. Heal up. Okay. And yeah, they heal 50 health each time, it seems. Uh, hello. I sing of Golden Throne, the hero whom Ray bore, uh, bear. Queen of the Immortals is she, surpassing all in beauty. She is the sister and the wife of Love Thundering Zeus, the glorious one whom all the blessed throughout in high Olympus have re reference and honor even as Zeus who delights in thunder. Okay. All of those. Are these lock pickable? Yes. Hydra fangs. Let's see. With heads cur uh, carved from rare hydra bone, these arrows split into three shafts when loosened. Okay. And some more money. See, have I been no missing any of those? In. Yeah. <laughs> but then I missed some armor over there. Oh well. So I just suspect it was saved for these occasions. Definitely, yeah. Actually, that's behind. Okay, we don't have any lockpicks anymore, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing any. So, yeah. Okay, new shields. We still have the other. No, we don't have the other ones. We only have one shield. Why are okay. Doing this? Out of my way, peasant. The gods have forsaken you. Resign to your fate and leave this world to stronger men. <laughs> Got him on the swing. We'll see who's the stronger man, huh? Yep. As he knocks me across the room. There. Oh yeah, this is a big one. <laughs> Bright ember glowing from within a dying hearth. Arise, my chosen. Arise, Nicandrios. You stand before Hera, fairest amongst all goddesses, divine queen of Olympus. Under the shadow of the mountain, humanity gasps its last breath. The gods have abandoned me. Zeus, king of gods and men, my husband, has turned his back on your people. He has broken the sacred contract between deities and mortals. He has betrayed you. You see, we are alike, you and I. Wife and son, wounded by husband and father. Unfaithful in matrimony, he discards his oaths for lesser creatures. Irresponsible in patriarchy, he discards his mortal subjects, like an ungrateful child tossing away his toys. The law of Zeus is absolute, and the Olympians are compelled to obey. Without the seeds of Demeter, your crops fail. Without the grace of Artemis, your forests are barren. Without the gaze of Apollo, your minds stumble in darkness. But I, as queen, am not so easily a coward. Step to the altar, Nicandrios. Of course, <laughs> like if Zeus could, if Zeus you know, could behave him fucking self, then like the whole <laughs> the entirety of Greek mythology would probably fit in a fucking pamphlet. I present to you a choice. <laughs> Ascend Mount Olympus, strip these callous gods of their power, and cast down Zeus from his lofty throne. Stand up to the cruel deities of Olympus and earn your people's salvation. Or remain here without the gifts of the gods and watch your world turn to ashes. Not really much of a choice, huh? For too long has my husband escaped the consequences of his actions. But together we will take what is owed. Okay, that must have been some really good herbs for him to get that high. 
Oh dear. And let's be honest, back in those days, they really did smoke a lot of weird herbs. Most of it was to do most of it for attempted medical practices. Yeah, and just uh, quote unquote contacting the gods. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. Okay. Altar of Zephyr. Zephyr, god of the west wind, can be called upon to carry the deities of the Olympus from one area to another. Yeah, this is fast travel. <laughs> we are at the Olympian gates. By mandate of Zeus, father of gods and men, king upon the mountain, the Olympian gates are open to all deities who seek refuge here. Though your domains on Earth lie in ruin, Zeus welcomes you into his home during this time of transition. Once the mortal issue has been resolved, you will all be free to return to the Earth. As guests of Zeus's hospitality, strict adherence to his laws is expected. Violence and theft will be met with the wrath of Olympus. Yeah, basically... <laughs> the Olympian police. Okay, they spoke over each other. Zeus from the many folded peak <clears throat> from the many folded peak of Olympus told Themis to summon all the gods into assembly. She went everywhere and told them to make their way to Zeus's house. There was no river that was not there, except only Okeanos. There was not one of the nymphs who live in the lovely groves, and the nymphs of river spirits, and the nymphs of grassy meadows who came not. These all assembling into the house of Zeus' cloud gathering took place among the smooth stoned cloister walks. Okay, from Homer the Iliad. Okay, anything further down this way? Okay. It's looking more for exploration and possible loot, though it doesn't look like that will be the case. Eh? Before you know it, then it'll be just like old times, before the humans. Yeah. <laughs> yes, they're attempting genocide on all of humanity. Uh. Yeah, that is something also in Greek mythology, like the gods are fickle as fuck. Especially Zeus. Sensor. Plume of Hera required. Okay. We'll have to move on then. And return there some other time. The Agora. Okay. Find the Sheaf of the Dem Demeter. The Lyre of Apollo. The Bow of Artemis. Okay. And we have two places, or no, three places. Okay. What the Abandoned heck is house. that? Hmm? The, that animal, what the heck is that? Uh, maybe some sort of hyena or something? Uh, maybe a hyena? Anyways, let me take a look. Okay. What have we here? Goddess of seed, of fruits abundant, fair harvest and thrashing are your constant care. The nurse of all mortals who first joined plowing oxen to the yoke and gave to men what, na what nature is once require, but plenteous means of bliss which all desire. Or fake him to Demeter. Okay. Let's see then. Mm, that's a lot of grain. Yeah, I think there's something else. Like, Zeus does shit on Hera a lot. This is horrible. Yeah. However, oh, yep. who there is the one thing. My house. A mortal come to us for my blessings of growth, I suppose. Alas, I can no longer give such gifts. The fields of men shall forever lie fallow. Zeus has split the heavens from the earth. Mortals from gods. Even if I were to break the Edict of Zeus, I only hold half the solution. 
My powers lie with the ripening of things already set in motion. The power of new life, of spring, I gave to my precious daughter, Persephone. She reigns far below with Hades, Lord of the Dead. There she will stay, as Zeus commands. The sweet touch of spring will never bless the soil again. Okay. Oh dear. And yeah. Yeah. Not uh, all gods <laughs> agree with him. Yeah. Also, there's also the fact that Hera is jealous and spiteful as all fuck. Uh, let's not forget that, if I remember right, she's also his sister or half-sister? Yeah. So, there is a little bit you may understand Zeus in that regard. Now, I, I don't think he's above uh, that, seeing as, well, some of the things he has pulled himself. Uh -huh. yeah. Point taken. Let's see, bunch of locked places. Yeah, but I do know that not all the gods were... How to say this? Bad, Arses evil... towards the humans? <laughs> yeah, they... So, some like them, some were just outright neutral. It caught. You have broken the laws of Olympus. Pay tribute or submit to the judgment of Zeus. Okay, just no random, <laughs> no random destruction. Okay. Very wise. We'll be watching. You. Yeah, probably best to uh... not go pissing off all the guards then. <laughs> oh, th th that's new. <clears throat> Okay, Only I thought look. you would get away with that in the, with these kinds of games. <laughs> yeah, let's see, this is the market. Uh, a weapon trainer? Oil up. Today you train with the best. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, so this is how we can increase damage with certain types of things. I, I'm not sure I've ever found this before. Uh, hmm. Wait, if there's that, then there's might be even something about upgraded the durability maybe me the proper herbs and the agents and I'll set to work on any potion you need let's see nectar of healing no oh, repair kit recipe a small set uh, yeah, a set of small metal and leather working yeah, working tools to repair armor from the wear and tear of battle repairs 50 armor <coughs> elixir of vigor they were horribly, <laughs> they were horribly unpleasant taste. This burning liquor will bestow great strength and savagery upon the drinker. 200% more damage, immune to knockback and attack interrupts. Lost for only 30 seconds. That would be really useful in boss fights, at least. Infusion of alacrity. This sweet-smelling syrup brings invigorating swiftness to the drinker's reactions, allowing them to move like quicksilver. 25% faster attack speeds. Attacking no longer slows movement and faster spring momentum. Drop of Radiance. A single ray of sunshine caps in an enchanted vessel. When released, it will chase away the darkness more than the brightest torch. Light Aura. Okay. And Blast Jar Recipe. A powerful bomb made from carefully prepared reagents packed into a small clay urn and lit by a timed fuse. Okay. These two sound very useful. Though, let's look around a bit more. Yeah, the electricity. The, the, the first time I heard of that word was in Guild Wars 2. Second time in Asia's Wonders 4. Mm -hmm. First time here. Artisan armor. Okay, and here we can get upgrades to armor. These are decently cheap. Leather bracers. A skull cap. Leather greaves. Let's just upgrade the cheapest each time. Wait, are you changing? Appearance, yes. Nice. The greaves, light helmets, and we have one more, the bronze bracers. Okay. And now we have a lot more maximum armor. Okay, I like the system. No, 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 no,
Now, I think it basically is. I think it's basically a fancy word for swiftness and such. All right, just a busy, a fancy word that's actually rarely used, I guess. Yeah. Okay, what do we have in here? Let's see. That's a, that's a fish. Yep, gonna some sort of a dog cat thing. Okay. And that just puts us out up here. Okay. Hmm. Let's keep moving on then. Donkey. Yep. <laughs> Two gods are first among men. The goddess Demeter, she is the earth, but call her whatever name you wish. She nourishes mortals with dry food, but he who came afterwards, Dion Dion Dionysus, Dionysus, yep, Dionysus, yep, <laughs> I'm blanking. We'll probably hear how it's said. Discovered a match to it, the liquid drink of the grape, and introduced it to mortals. It releases wretched mortals from grief whenever they are filled with the stream of the vine and gives them sleep. A means of forgetting their daily troubles, nor is there any other cure for hardships. Erephides Bake. Okay. The vineyard of Dionysus. Of course. Dionysus. Let's see. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> and of course, it's one big party hall. Welcome to the party, Are you so my friend? To... You look like a robust yep. fellow. How about a little drinking contest? And there's satyrs walking well, around. Drink my wine, drink and be merry. Let the joy of inebriation wash away the storm clouds of these troubled times. Uh, Drink to keep the dismal phantom of sobriety at bay. If you cannot keep pace with the Thiasis of Dionysus, <laughs> then you have no place within these halls. Yeah, everyone's drunk here. Yeah. I should have gotten that from what the first painting on the wall I saw. A drunken man laying on the back of a donkey, staying <laughs> up at the sun. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Charming is the vehemence of satyrs when they dance, and charming their ribaldry when they laugh. They are given to life, noble creatures that they are, and they subdue the Lydian women to their will by their art by their artful flatteries. And this too is true of them. They are hardy, hot-blooded beings with prominent ears, lean about the loins, altogether mischievous, and having the uh, something of horses. <laughs> Might be good that that Ails. last that word was blocked it was and, and bonk wave <laughs> knockout. Tales of horses. I don't remember them having that. First of all, here them having tales of horses, but the text seems to be taken from uh, actual sources. Okay. I, I do remember this. I think we have to just grab all of the wine we can. And we'll try to down it down uh, down it before uh, some time runs out. Uh, okay, that is blocked off. Uh, let's look at that some other time. Oh, oh wait, there's stuff up there. <laughs> okay. If there is a timer running, I'm not looking. I'm not seeing it. But there is a I reason to do all this. this. Yeah, I haven't noticed the timer, but yeah, yeah, that, that, that's the thing that I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. For whatsoever vex Demeter, vex also Dionysus. For Dionysus shares the anger of Dem Demeter. <laughs> that's, that's him. That's the mad god himself. Okay. Get this drinking contest started. Oh, what the heck? That's that statue. <laughs> of course. Oh, that's a heavy drinker. Yep. Okay, it seems that there is. We need to. Yeah, there is a certain time between the drinks that we. Well, if we don't, if we hit that, we knock ourselves. We get knocked out. And tossed on our ass out. Okay. Okay, the drinking slows us down for a moment. There. 
Give me that. This goes without saying, people. Don't do this at home. Don't. Yeah. And out again. Okay, there is a certain way to grab all of these. Uh, hello there. <laughs> no drunken disorderly going on here, sir. No, none at all. Oh, dear. Also, fun fact. The reason you may see a lot of lions in Greek artwork is for there were lions in Greece once. Okay. But if you can guess how they got ex extinct. Yeah, hunting many uh, other things. No. Actually, not hunting. The Romans. All uh, right. Yep. They they just kept it so many for the arenas. The, I guess some hunting for protected sheets were done, but the Romans just uh, yeah, they just grabbed as much as they could for the arenas. And apparently the same happened to the North African lion. Okay. Hence why they are, as far as I know, no lions in, Afri in North yeah. Africa or in Greece anymore. For Romans, uh. Just grabbed so many for the arenas. Just in time, I think, there, and doors. Uh, come on. Okay. Oh, uh, come, on. come on, come on, come on, quick. There. Okay. Three more. Yep. Oh, come on. Okay. So, probably good to have both of those doors open first. And yes, there is a reason to do this, I believe. Okay. We don't start yet. Okay. Open that up. Okay, any other doors anywhere around here to open up? I'm pretty sure the normal ones will just get closed if we open them up. Hmm. Uh, hello. Okay, there, there's one over there, but how do we get in there? And yeah, these close quickly enough. Is it supposed to do it now, or is it supposed to return later? Hmm. Okay, how do you get to that one, or uh, like that? We had, we need more momentum to make the jump up to that. And yeah, we have a limited bit of wall jumping there. Hmm. There. Okay. Let's open this up. And maybe it's actually a better idea to... No, wait. There's still one more door. That needs to be opened, so we don't have to go all around it. Okay. This should be a, the good run, I'm guessing, where we can grab all of them. Okay. Jump. Okay, now I think I just miss theory due to what we are about to do. What? I would have said rum. <laughs> Run. Okay, here yeah, we go. Rum and rum. Okay, I can see why I miss here that, especially in this context. Oh, dear. Okay, give me that. Let me just crab walk for a bit. There. Up down. Give me that. Okay, uh, this one. That one. Yep. That one. Okay, everyone is just fall dropping down around us because they can't keep up with the alcohol. Okay, do we really need to grab each and every one of them? It does look like it because there's only two left. Yep. Okay, and there we go. No, there's still fucking one. No, it's Leonis himself. Leonis. My, my, it seems like everyone else has had too much wine. What a pity. 
Meddlesome eavesdroppers would have much to gossip. I know who you are and why you're here, Nicandrios. The vines of Dionysus creep to all corners of the world. Zeus is a tyrant and a fool to separate the gods from the earth. There are many on Olympus who oppose his rule in secret. I will continue to play the fool to learn what I can from loosened tongues. But you, you are more direct, I think. You will soon draw the wrath of Zeus himself and will need all the help you can get. I give to you my sacred cantharos, font of my power. Let the taste of joyous times flow back to your people. Ha-ha! <laughs> Go with my blessings, my friend! Yeah. Let's see. Cantharos of Dionysus. This humble earthen drinking cup carries the power of wine and freedom. Joyous times and social euphoria flow from, this, yeah, from its rim like a wellspring. Potions last 25% longer. And... Oh, did you get healed, or did you just get permanent health upgrade? Uh, let's see, I'm probably healing. Oh, actually, yeah, I think we got that. I believe there was 100 earlier, now it's 105, so we get two bonuses from that. Oh, yeah. so I was right, uh, the, the or I remember right, uh, the, this is in a game, not even if you call it. Yeah, even before the game, I think there were a lot of guards who liked humans and some that disliked them. Yeah. And, well, Dionysus is hardly the fool he can seem to be at all times. <laughs> Let's see. I sing of Artemis, whose shafts are gold, who cheers on the hounds, the pure maiden, shooter of stags, who delights in archery, own sister to Apollo with the golden sword. Over the shadowy hills and windy peaks, she draws her golden bow, rejoicing in the chase and sending out grievous shafts. <laughs> the tops of the high mountains tremble, and the tangled, we the tangled wood echoes awesomely with the outery of beasts, earthquakes, and the sea, where also fish show. Okay. So, that's a word I really, really hear nowadays. I think it's typically described, used to describe something in shallow waters. It... Okay. Wait, what? Uh, that's a first. And it had its own error. Let's see. A, a wrong place. Okay, that... wait, did it just not... Did it not save there? Load game, slot 2... Okay, it has the auto saves at least. Okay, that could have gotten bad. Okay, let's avoid Artemis for a moment then. Hmm... Actually... Let me see if that happens again. No. Okay, that... That's just weird. Yeah. Do I trust they actually have their own unique error message? <laughs> the forest reveals a fresh-faced hunter. Come to test yourself against the wilderness of Artemis. The maiden has no time for the pleas of simple men. Stand above these other huntsmen who play with their toys. Become the fiercest beast in the wild. Slay the great wolf. Cut down the venomous chimera. Cast out the boorish satyrs who pollute our shrine. Show your worth to the eyes of Artemis, and she will cast her favor upon you. Boris nymphs. Okay. It looks like there are other hunters here. The that one was just drawing a bow at a rabbit. I think you'll want to go for bigger prey than a rabbit to try and get Artemis's attention. <clears throat> Let's see. The deep-breasted mountain nymphs rank neither with mortals nor with immortals. Long indeed do they live, eating ambrosia and treading the lovely dance among the immortals. At their birth pines, our high-topped oaks spring, upon, they spring up with them upon the fruitful earth's beautiful flourishing trees, towering high upon the lofty mountains. 
But when the fate of death is near at hand, first those lovely trees wither where they stand, and the bark shrivels away about them, and the twigs fall down, and at the last the life of the nymph and the obstinate tree leave the light of the sun together. Okay. Deep breasted? Uh, yeah, pretty sure that means <laughs> big <laughs> in the old uh, language. Yeah, for, I haven't seen many translations. They end up do using, like, no deep present. Another time I heard is uh, when they describe Gaia, wide bosomed. <laughs> okay, let's go hunt ourselves some big beasts then. Uh, if I can find my way towards them. And it's uh, not seeing anything of a breath bar. Three, two, one. Enter oh. swamp. Okay, this is where the chimera is. Oh, great. Follow the acid trail to find the chimera. Oh, dear. Okay, yeah, it looks like terrifying. we can hold, It looks like we can hold multiple weapons of the ones that we can throw, like the spears and daggers. Blasted wolves. A rats. A, a boulder. <laughs> Completely miss. Okay, we we can get some gold from them from killing them. Also, let's move to yeah, something that strikes a bit faster. No, I guess. I guess you ought to get money from pelt. Um. What's that? <laughs> Fucking nuke rat. Uh, that's some sort of boar-headed beast. Yeah, that is a boar-head. Okay, and they pounce. Did I just phase through the geometry? Okay. I think so? Okay, for some reason the game is being a bit glitchy, it seems. Okay, why is Maybe it showing that? It's up in the corner now with the boar heads. Is that showing that's why I that the... rarely seen people do playthrough of it. But they do a showcase and just leave. That's... Okay. Summer <laughs> 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 got a wolf into the stratosphere. Okay, up in the upper left that is that shows how many enemies are aggroed on us. Okay. Moving on. It's. Wait, I'm pretty sure that's not a fool, but a Biden. <laughs> okay, something I should check on in a bit if 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 those walls can be broken by normal attacks as well, because if they are just vines, then I'm. Kind of wasting it, and then I'm wasting Greek fire on them. That yeah, motherfucker. Oh, okay, I'm getting a bit sick of this. Come on, there we go. Can Ooh. I press break? Yes, I. Okay, yeah, I've been wasting oh, Greek fire. Oh. Yeah, you took that very personal heal. You, I saw where you stabbed. these here we go no clue what have we over here okay it's just another route through that did give me a bit of armor hmm. oh but the, there you come from 
Oh my god! Okay, let me break these. No loot. Not even a boot. Okay, it seems that there's multiple trials going around with the acid. Yep, yep, mother. Okay, at least he throws us far enough away that it actually breaks aggro. So there. Okay. A bronze maze. I'll take that. Lockpick. Uh, Some more stuff. Fish. Okay, what is... Okay, Nectar of Healing and a Repair Kit. Okay, I had a rare momentary pixelation, and I thought the fish was a person at first. <laughs> Another... Oh. Oh. I'll take that. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> okay, apparently these wolves can just leap <laughs> like a freaking baseball player. And that's a dead end. That's the first one. Leap like and... a baseball player. I get what you mean. Just... I was telling you that metaphor. I wouldn't really call it a metaphor. It's more an accurate description. Uh, okay, me that. Let's not say that for that poor man was holding a boulder. We don't want him to slam dunk it on you. <laughs> that. Let's see. Okay. We can't use these yet to make anything. Okay, let's see if we can follow the trail further. Yep, more vines. Yep. <laughs> Thank you for clearing the way somewhat. Still hate you, still gonna kill you. Yep. Need to refill. These bastard things really just hit and run. Yeah. <laughs> Shove a blade up its ass. Okay. Now, are we back on the trail or are we going back on the trail? Hmm. I'll take these. And I think we've just been going back on where the trail was coming from to begin with. Hmm. Oh, wait. There's literally a... Is that... Is that... Okay, there is the arrow to point us towards an objective, but I'm not seeing any on the map there, unless it's too far away for that. Hmm. Okay, but we'll just have to keep following this then. Okay. And even if even if that is actually pointing to where the chimera is, it still wouldn't help us with this maze. Yeah. This way. Mm, hello. Agnida bore the chimera, who snorted raging fire, a beast great and terrible and strong and swift-footed. Her heads were three. One was that of a glare-eyed lion, one of a goat, and the third of a snake, a powerful dragon. Yeah, yeah, that's typically how chimeras are shown. Yeah, do a bit more lion-like than tiger-like? Let's see... There we go. Hmm. Let's bring the axe for this. Because I'm pretty sure it is here. 
Yeah, there it is. Yep. All right, yeah, the, the goat spits fire. Oh, snorts, as they said. Oh, why didn't they give me the tiger head when it's supposed to be a lion's? A uh, slightly different take. Uh, possibly for pe people have been very experimental with cameras. Actually, Blizzard, but they made the uh, cameras that the night elves use. That uh, no, no, it no, looks no. like a camera that we used to. Yeah, typically, chimera is also just used to be, you know, to describe any mixed beasts. There we go. Yeah, dude, there is an honor official name for it. I think it's... I think the English word would be possibly... Fable animal? Maybe. Okay, we broke our sword on its, on its face. Okay, now we just have to find our way back, and apparently it's been sniping on the nymphs. Well, let's uh, be honest. Do you think it's picky? No. Uh, wait, wait. Why do you think it's been snacking the nymphs? Uh, because there were corpses in there. I'm... I think I saw the two skulls earlier, but I missed all the corpses. Okay. Let's see, there's a chest in the lower left there. I think I want to try and grab that. Uh, okay, back in the darkness here. Yeah, we can actually use the map to navigate through this place somewhat, but still probably good to keep the torch in hand just in case we get jumped again, uh, like that. Yeah, I think you lured, you lured this one here. And there goes the shield. There we go. I probably should have chucked a few Greek fire at it, but I will. Let's just hope that we find a replacement shield pretty quick then. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here's the chest. Let's see. Oh, hello. Hydrofang. And heroic Xiphos, a keenly edged war sword fit only for a hero of Greece. And a blast Ooh. mine, heavily loaded with blasting power and triggered by gearwork tripwires. This devastating trap can obliterate entire phalanges. Enemies are. <laughs> okay, so it, it's, a, it's a fire mine. I'll take those as well. Oh, wait. Phalanxes is another word for phalanx, ain't it? Uh, or ph phalangus. Uh, uh, maybe just different wording. There's something red over there, so we are not getting, going yeah. over there. I guess it's the plural form of phalanx. Maybe. Uh, I'm probably... hardly an expert on old Greek terms and such. Yeah. I, I gotta guess uh, that was probably the word Captain Souls tried to figure out when he played tabs. Open this up. Okay. The... Ow. Is that a Wait, bear trap or something? Happened? I think I walked into a bear trap of some kind. Okay. Let's try getting. Uh, let's try to avoid getting harassed by wolves all the time. And of course, we need to go right past them. I... Okay. Oh, oh come on! <laughs> And let's not. Let's try not to use our likely best weapon at the moment. Should probably save that for the bigger beasts. 
Okay. Now, what are we going to find over here? Let's see. Hear me, the nymphs who haunt the pleasant woods, or of those who inhabit this lovely mountain and the springs and rivers, <coughs> the springs of rivers and yeah, grassy meads. I will make you an altar upon a high peak in a far-seen place, and will sacrifice rich offerings to you at all seasons. Okay. Now, I believe a lot of, uh, I believe a lot of altars to. Th Ooh, that's a lot of red. Oi, footpath! I no room anywhere else on Olympus. Unless you've got wine or tits, get lost! Of course. <clears throat> uh, what was... Yeah, I, I believe a lot of uh, altars and sh such to Artemis were, well, put in far away high places. Yeah. Okay. Oh, dear. Satyrs shaking their hair madly in the winds learned from Dionysus how to trot the grapes with dancing steps. They pulled tight the dappled skins of fawns over the shoulder. They shouted the song of Bacchus sounding uh, tongue with tongue, uh, crushing the fruit with many a skip of the foot, crying uh, whatever, how, however that's supposed to be said. The wine spurted up in the grape uh, field hollow. The runlets were empurpled, pressed by the alternating tread. The fruit bubbled out red juice with white foam. Okay. Uh, that's locked. This we can pick. Now yeah, it also needs to be. Nope. Blossom of Artemis required. Okay. That's, that's sure it, right? Yeah, uh, we, we're selling, and <laughs> yeah, pretty sure this is a wine press over this, uh, this thing. Okay, how are we supposed to get down to break the satyr's wine, then? Hmm. I'm guessing we may get it after hunting the other wolf, or the other beast, the great wolf. I put this in the, in the uh, uh, map said die wolf. A die wolf, okay. Yeah, do the, the names did say the great wolf, so. That is just right out here in the open. Uh, I don't have a shield. Are you sure there's a wolf? It's supposed to be. I, I yeah, now it's not like leave a them behind. Okay, at least we can collect these after throwing them around. And did they just run? The fucker is running off. Okay, at least it's a smarter wolf then. I don't want to deal with you two. They should lose interest soon enough. Uh, what have we here? Uh, we've read it already. Yep. Uh, great. Now we have the big one and the smaller one. Yep. No heal. And this thing hurts quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, I, I really need a shield. Uh, <laughs> okay, just timing out for a moment. And off it goes again. What the heck? Also, gonna grab some more to drink. Actually, it probably would be better if I tried to kill these with ranged weapons. Yep, especially ranged weapons I can... Oops! <laughs> Sorry, dude! <laughs> Just put a spear in the back of his neck. Oops. Ooh, so you may have accidentally killed yep. a nymph earlier then. No, I think, I think there was one getting a, about to get hit by something, but they just poofed away with a giggle. 
Thank you. Okay. Let me grab that again as well. And yeah, it also makes more sense that well, we're in a, in a hunting area. It, it a lot, makes a lot more sense to use more typical hunting weapons it, instead of trying to fight these things in melee. If I can hit it. There we go. I thought I heard earlier whimpering, not giggle. Okay. Well, that was the wolf. Let's see. Trophy of the wild required. Okay. Wait, that. Was that a lion or a manticore in there? Not sure. So let's put that torch away. It's not out, not of much use. Okay, uh, let's make a few more of these. Mm. Yeah, I, I like that they have it's four, uh, yeah, five by two here to show you how many of those you have available at the moment. Instead of having like a number or yeah, having it extend a lot further than would be necessary. Okay. No, let's try the satyrs again. <laughs> I thought they were going to attack me, but no. They're after the wolf. Okay. There we go. Give me that. And he just he just goes on for drinking. Of course. Oh, protected. Oh, oh I see. Drink. There we go. Uh, we go what around. What are you two doing? Would it try to have a hypnosis fight off? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Ooh. Assassin arrow found. These bladed arrows silence those who never see it coming. Deals 800% damage when hits in the enemy's back. Okay. An assassin dagger. 800 damage from behind. Or 800%. His needle sharp knife silences those who never saw it coming. Okay. He's Some more arrows. Added to black market. Okay, that means that we should be able to buy them if we want to, but... Let's be honest, I don't think we're going to be facing most enemies from behind. That opened this up. Unless they accidentally turn the back on you. When you when they are when you're evading them and all that. Maybe. Okay. And oh I get it now. The reds the red circles are things we need to destroy to get the satyrs out of here. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. I, I thought... think I'm... It won. I, I thought they instant killed me there for some reason, but no, they just knocked me the fuck out. Yeah, and I think we know, now know who to use the assassin stuff on. Probably, yeah. Um... Okay. Okay, give me all of that. Some new javelins, because they do get damaged. <clears> hmm. <throat> Should be worried when it's hard to know if they're gurgling on wine or gurgling on their own blood. Probably the latter. Okay, how do... They're facing towards us, so it's not really possible. I just need to bring... I just need to break the wine. Not actually kill the um... ah, shield. Give me that. Not related. Help the shield. Yep. Yep. <laughs> 
okay, that's one hit away. Still find it weird that they managed to knock us out in one hit, but I guess that must be a special weapon or something they're using. Either way, it doesn't actually harm us too much, it only wastes our time a bit. Oh, <laughs> hit the on this side and skipped off it. Okay. Well, I, I think uh, I know something that might help uh, sober these satyrs up a bit. A cold shower? <gasps> a very hot one. <laughs> Thank you. What happens to wine we throw fire at it? Let's see. There's a brute wilderness in the Fennel Ones reverence it well. Okay, so yeah, those are special weapons they're using. And yeah, it typically burns. And well, seeing as they are drinking like there's no tomorrow, well, it's an easy guess as to what happens with them then. Let's see. Oh, no, now we're stuck with the metal elements of uh, Satyrs in a forest fire we pop like a koala. There we go. It's still horrible. Let's try and be a bit sneaky about this. Hmm. What's been going on here that the place is just filled with assassin's arrows? Off, question. <laughs> yeah, I'm guessing. Uh, I'm guessing other hunters have tried to get them out already, or something. There. Ready? Okay, don't know what that is, don't want to know. Because this is probably the sewer of the temple. Back off, brother! <laughs> stab, stab me in the knee with those stupid wands. Okay, get up. Let's see. Okay, only two... <clears throat> only two left to break. Mm. Yeah, if if they actually would kill us, that would make this a lot more annoying. Especially since they are quite, you know, they are quite tough in health, at least. Or maybe my sword just sucks. This is the no yeah, that's the normal Zivos. or how you're supposed to pronounce it. I think you all pronounce it right. It has been no as I heard it pronounced. Yep. And another one to the knee. Like, I'm, I'm just going to take the Assassin's Dagger and try and get by them. <clears throat> okay. Uh, might have been audible there, but that was the aunt and uncle taking your leave. I'm sure. Was that a door to heard slam? Maybe. Like, that I, was only it's a, bit it's a bit unclear at times as to what the mic will pick up that I can hear and what it won't pick up. Here we go. Nothing personnel. What do you mean, nothing personal? Yeah, the, the meme is nothing personnel, kid. What meme was you all know about? <laughs> One you obviously do not know, then. <laughs> Hill, have you, have you ever known me able to follow mean trends. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the answer. Yeah, it's from something. I, I don't know if it's a gag dub or just a completely fluffed line in a, an actual dub. Okay. Here 
we go. Yo, dude. Okay, someone really wanted you gone. Get out of here, you bastard! Let's see, will they actually lose interest if I just run a f far enough away, or will they just continue to chase? Oh, yeah, it's lowering. There are some things that this game just doesn't really tutorialize. Okay. Uh. <laughs> okay, he just couldn't climb the freaking ladder with his staff and shield. Or yeah, wand and shield, oh well. Actually, from seeing those ladders, I do think those ladders are well designed to handle hooves. Yeah. So it was probably very uncomfortable for him to using them. Along with well carrying as them stuff and spear. Stuff. Stuff in shield. There we go. Okay, that should be all. Yeah, there's still a few stragglers. Okay. Also, quick little look in here. A repair kit. Uh, 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 okay, that was a bit wasteful. Uh, wait, does it? Okay. Hmm. Does it? I'm guessing it now prioritizes the the armor healing because our health was already full. And it sounds like someone forgot something because that was the doorbell. You not hear the doorbell. Okay. That, that just describes it. things that sound loud enough to me. Give me a sec. Sounds like someone might have locked ah. themselves up. That's what I heard. That's what I heard. Okay, nobody forgot anything. It's well, they forgot one thing to turn off the lights in the car, so the battery's flat. All the woods Which one of you did this? <laughs> well, their loss. Or win. <laughs> okay. No. The, that happened. Yeah, but there, there are a bunch of angry drunks. What else like would happen? The last mortal to hunt alongside Artemis was mighty Orion. Hmm, but then he fell to Scorpio's sting. Yes, and the last man to see the sacred grove was poor Actian. Ah, oh, devoured by his own hounds. Do you think your fate will be better? Run along, little champion. The huntress waits for you. Okay, find the bow of Artemis. I very much doubt that she'll give it up willingly, though. Ah, that's the entry. That's the back entrance to the swamp. Yeah, I, I think we actually. I think we actually got hit. <laughs> Feeling a bit inadequate, man. Uh, wait, pants? You didn't use pants in this era. A random fun fact. Many yeah. Romans banned pants in Rome. Okay. Uh, also, oddly, Minecraft plant uh, tree there. I, I don't think it's supposed to be square, especially when the other ones are actually <laughs> like that. I, I, I'm not sure which tree you meant there. Yeah, there was one blocky one to the right. I almost have missed that. Oh, uh, yeah. I think the, the one reason they did it is because, well, Apparently they found the pants in inappropriate for many dolls and such run around with pants but shirtless. Lock picks, those are useful. Okay, lucky that there was water here. Hello there. Nice stay for angling. Yeah, I, I guess fishing counts as a type of hunting. Nice 
let's see. Hmm? Which is hollow? Hello. Artemis might not be too fond of you being here. Okay, a snake. Nick. Hello. A visitor comes to my humble house. You have come seeking my services? Oh, hello. Wolf dust, hollow dark teeth filled with the fermented blood of a stag will summon a little wolf, companion. Hog dust, striped feathers, crushed eggshells, and burned millet can call forth two spectral birds of prey to hunt for their master. Okay, I've never seen this before. And then we have recipes to make them ourselves, as well as a flask of warding. With the consistency and taste of liquid metal, this potent elixir briefly turns skin to iron. Temporary invulnerability. We should buy all these, shouldn't we? Yeah, and bottled shadows recipe. Stopper death mist of the goddess Achilles. Uh, inhaling the smoky vapors of this uh, veil will allow the user to blend into the darkness unseen by most eyes. Invincibility from unaware common enemies. Okay. Definitely buying that, though. Okay, I didn't know there'd be other shops around. Also, yeah. Sigil of the Necromancer. Hmm? Okay, this is going to be interesting. After years of sightless scrying, sifting through the inky veil of Tartarus, I finally uncovered the identity of the necromancer, Gwilym. But alas, he is dead now. Zeus be cursed, and I doubt even his own ample powers will be able to bring back his shade yeah, to bring his shade back from the underworld. Okay. Also, yoink. And I think you're able to afford another recipe now. A visitor comes to my. Let's see. Uh, Wolf dust or hawk dust? Which of these two shall we get? We've gotten quite a few wolf teeth, so we probably make have an easier time making this. Yeah, for I haven't seen seen the but we used to make the hawks from. Let's see. Yeah, wolf dust, which is sacrificial oil. And one wolf, uh, bang up, that's it's said there at the bottom as well. Oh, oh, hello, and we use those for the flask of warding. Okay, yeah, we're definitely topping off on that whenever we find more of those that we can pick up. Yep, this was a really good find. A really good find. Makes me wonder, have they updated since the last time you played? Maybe, or maybe I just completely missed all of these things. Uh, it's not impossible. Hmm. I'll check after we're done when the last update was. Also, there's something over here. Or did we go through here before? Oh, no, it's, this is a hidden area. We, I'm pretty sure we passed. Yeah, we passed through here before to get into the swamp. Yeah, okay. But, uh, I think this game is rather old by now. So, again, first one I saw play this was Yatsepticeye. It was probably before hit one million or just hit one million. Let's not oh, use this. When he still had his hat on often. Yep. Okay, don't know what they did there, but they destroyed something. Yep. There we go. Need that some health and armor. Uh, uh, fucking. Uh. Miss. At least the arrows don't immediately break when they miss and such. Uh. Uh, even more. You're lucky you. If uh, you give me at least some uh, money from all of this. King <laughs> over eager wolves. Give me those. Okay. Let's 
Yeah, we're going to need to take the highway around this. And there. Man trying to hunt a rabbit and not even hitting the broadside of the widest barn nearby. A hunting lodge? Okay. It seems like there's a lot of optional stuff that I just did not know about. Also, yoink. I'll take a, a fresher shield. Bear jaws. Oh yeah, the, that must be what we stepped in. What I stepped into earlier. Uh, so I'm concerned we can summon bears. Uh, I, I believe. I think that was a bear trap. No, those are what they are calling bear traps. You make for a fine hunter. You just need the right arrows and traps. And let me. Yeah, you are another. You are another shop. Sentry recipe. This gearwork automaton designed by Hephaestus will launch arrows at anyone who comes near. Glass jar, bear jaws. Yeah, see? This iron what? leg trap will snap shot when stepped on, injuring and slowing the hapless victim. Warbell again. I'm, I'm presuming they're getting done. help getting the battery charged now. Oh dear. Hmm. Are you guess bear yo what might be the original name for bear traps? Probably. Let's see. Anything around here? Extra health. Ah, there we go. The Sacred Grove of Artemis. Nothing behind here. Okay. Okay, everyone else who has entered here has not survived. So let's try and be the first, huh? Hello. Yeah. All right. I guess Ryan was more. So uh, most... this is the master hunter that my birds sing of, the strongest and craftiest creature in all my realm. Now that Zeus has cut the link between the mountain and the earth, I grow so bored of this tiny garden. Gone are the golden days of the hunt. My arrows sit idle in their quiver, lacking a worthy target. But I wonder, does the master hunter make for master prey? Uh, reading chorus, huh? Okay, I'm pretty sure we see wasn't supposed to be sitting on air. <laughs> oh dear. Right, I want to say, was it Orion the damn giant? Mm, not sure. Well, I remember Orion being one of those damn to big. Catch me if you can, Huntsman. Okay, now we reverse the spell. And now the Huntress has become the Hunted. No, <laughs> that couldn't do. Okay, she's pulling the same thing we did. She, she's going for the altars or whatever those were. Actually, this would be a perfect time for the Assassin Arrows. Still got her, okay. And we're... Yep, and now it's our turn again. One. Okay. Okay, this yeah. is an interesting boss fight, but... Yeah. I, I don't think Whoops. I've ever seen a boss fight like this. You. Yeah. I believe there have been other boss fights where characters get transformed into stuff and such. Well, transformed, yes, just... This? Taking turns? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, I can't tell if these are actually dealing more damage to her or not. Okay, she's about to hit the third one. Yeah, no, I'm gonna be surprised if those arrows are not meant to be used on bosses possible okay two two yeah it is still a, a different take of a sorts 
on something that happens you know, is a decently common occurrence in games. Yeah, transformation, yes. Just taking turns on being transformed, dead, uh, transformed while hurting each other is definitely new. I guess you could say they took the rule thing to the next level. I guess, yeah. It can hear you. Here we go. Uh, he's trying to set up traps as well. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, what, what the door's going? Why is she tying her shoes? <laughs> Oh, sandals in this case. <laughs> I'm pretty sure sandals don't have laces. You aren't supposed to, at least. It... You see, have you see, just teleporting. sandals, you know. Okay, a few more. Still got her there. There we go. <laughs> she just drops out. <laughs> okay. Bow of Artemis. Crafted from flawless horn and golden sinew, this divine bow holds the power of the wilds, and its arrows will effortlessly pierce the heart of any unwary game. Quick reload with all bows. And we nope out of here. Our planet needs us. And that shattered her statue. Okay. Uh, please ignore the mess over there. Totally not me murdering a goddess. Okay. Now, next up is the Lyre of Apollo, or we go to Hades. Apollo's is closer, but we'll need to find a way to get over there. <clears throat> Pardon. So let's explore some. Oh, hello. Hey, put that away. Hmm. The first time we got commented on the, that. <laughs> Let's see. Can we pick any of these locks without uh, anyone getting pissed off? Okay. I'm guessing the guards will if they see us picking the lock. Let's see. Nope. It. Nope. Yeah. Of Olympus. Pay trip. Fine. Very wise. We'll be watching you. Okay, I thought it's they weren't around the here. Also, I don't think they said anything about picking locks. Okay, apparently they do get pissed off for me you getting in get here. It... Uh... <laughs> Yeah, well, I think your old, old school gamer habits are showing. Yeah, in a very bad way. That it actually backfires at you severely. Hey, yeah, it's one of them gone. Two of them gone. And we're actually getting a profit out of this, I think. There we go. Archer still. Yep. Come here, you. You <laughs> won't get far as I knock him into the air. Okay. So yeah, they after one time they will just go straight for the attack, it seems. 
Stop in the name of Zeus. Yeah, how about no? Help! Maybe you can help me by unlocking that door, though. Leave me alone. Let's see. Oops. Don't I want me. that. And okay, what? Oh, hello. Ow. So that's the Octobertons we may ourselves make, I guess. Yep. Okay, it will prioritize health over armor, it looks like. And okay, oh, hello, there's a page up there. Is that a recipe of some sort? Statuettes and oop, upgrade to heavy bracers. Infusion of electricity and five Olympian darts. A bundle of five Olympian darts, perfectly shaped and weight. These mastercrafted javelins fly far and pierce deep. Okay. Wait, you call it javelins darts? Apparently. Let's see, refugee notes. The watchmen were going to confiscate all my goods when they assigned me to this common house. Luckily, I got Dolores to, sta or Dallas to stash it away for me in a safe place. He's hiding out in the sewers until we can figure out a plan to move it. Okay, so not not only are they getting... You know, not, not only are they rather somewhat forcibly moving all the other... Uh, magical creatures to get Please up on Olympus. They're also just robbing them blind, apparently. Hello. Stop in the name of Zeus. Now, how about you stop in the name of Shut Up? Intruder. Now you are accurate there. Okay, now what have we here? A repair kit. And some more stuff for us to break. There we go. Okay. And... Okay, that, this might actually put us up high enough to actually get to Apollo's place. I just okay. pray the other gods don't go after you now. As Apollo goes through the house of Zeus, the gods tremble before him, and all spring up from their seats when he draws near as he bends his bright bow. Okay. Let's see, we've still got a good a bit of time. Let's see how much progress we can get on this. Okay, mind if we borrow that? The man who walks like a false god. I have seen you in the mists of prophecy. You seek salvation for your doomed homeland. Well, I'm afraid your time basking in the sunlight is over. Fathers declared that miserable place not worth the dirt it's made from. Yes. We've wasted enough sweat and tears on your mortal theatrics. The gods gift you with knowledge and civilization to free you from your savage roots. But time and time again, you've come up failed. And how many times have you idiots messed with <laughs> every civilization? Run along now. My music is not for your ears. Right, I might have something that is for your ears, though. If it's my attention you desire, then you shall have it. Help! Ow. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> But at least we got to firebomb the sun god. What the heck? And they took all of our equipment, of course. Hello? Is someone in there? Helios? I am Helios. The sun was once my prized treasure. But that snake Apollo stole it from me and imprisoned me down here. He has broken my body. Never again will I stand upon the burning chariot. Apollo is a powerful god. Any who stand against him are destroyed. Or worse. But I think I can help you. First you must escape this horrible place. I know of a secret passage. 
Unfortunately for me, all these years, it's been under your cell, not mine. Take these, my last slivers of sunlight. It will open the wall. A torch and some blast jars. Excellent. Now, escape from this prison. Now I'm a, now I'm a little bit curious what would happen if you were to waste these. You might actually get just as nonsense that game over. But let's not waste them. And okay, <laughs> the fuse starts the moment we start to take aim. So basically, throw it, don't hold it. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Oh gee, God. Bottled shadows. Okay, stealth section, I'm guessing. Bottled shadows. And more here. Actor of healing, bear jaws, bear jaws. Also, with the armor, I think typically when you find armor or the armor upgrades, it isn't exactly that you find a specific piece of armor, but you're more just a general upgrade. So no matter what armor you may have bought already before, you'll still get an improvement out of that. Which I say is really good design. Oh, yeah. Let's see, before we get out, anything over here? There's a lot more prisoners around here. Let's put that away. Yoink. Dungeon key. Okay, let's... Keep on being a bit sneaky. <laughs> okay, I'm just highly amused by firebombing Apollo. It's just something... Would it be ironic or fitting about that? I would show sure. it... Funny, yes. No, so much for stealth. Apollo, guide my arrow. Pin him to the wall. How about I pin you? Yep, it's one of one of those sentinels. Yep. Here we go. Aim for the eyes. Yeah, that's good advice. I'll make good use of it. Okay. Oop, what have we here? Oh, another prisoner. Apollo will regret this. Okay. Oh dear. Okay. From what Paul said, it makes me wonder if Paul is so just tired of humans warring against each other or something. With you, stranger. But it's still a bit bad way what he's doing since not everyone is like that. Yeah, and it, there's been plenty of times where just the gods have started wars among mortals for their own shits and gales. There we go. Oh, so you can get up here. Okay. And what's this? Helios the sun rides his chariot, he shines upon men and deathless gods, <clears throat> and pierces, uh, piercingly he gazes with his eyes from his golden helmet. Okay. Hmm. I know there is lore about Helios and Apollo, or... Hmm. Uh, could Helios be the... the Roman version, but... I'm pretty sure that the Greek version came before the Roman versions. Like, most of the Roman gods were basically just copy-pasted with their names changed. Yeah, uh, some other minor changes, but... Hmm. It was very obviously clearly in influenced. Uh, we're back here. Okay. And we'll have to go this way. Yoink. Iron Club. Uh, that shield is worse than what we're having, I'm guessing, from the fact that we can't pick it up. <laughs> and someone else took the guards and 
<laughs> took the guard's advice there. Get me out of that. And our loot. Loot. Lovely, lovely loot. And okay. someone up there has a big shield. With a face. Yep. <laughs> Yes. The yep. <laughs> destroyer has no mercy, but the destroyer just got destroyed. And we can't get his shield, damn it. Then again, we probably put a few holes into it. Probably. Okay, uh, let's fill up. Max on that. We are max on that. And max on... Okay. Okay, should be good now then. That shield is worse than what we're having, I think. Would be nice if we could carry around a backup shield for when, well, the one we're using inevitably breaks. Yeah, that would be nice. <clears throat> but yeah, you can't waste for everything. Yeah, and it probably would be a bit annoying to carry two shields. And again, Gaia Bear. Uh, oh wait, is he goes the Titan maybe instead? Uh, Gaia Bear to Uranus, the Sky, the Cyclops, uh, Cyclops, overbearing in spirit, Brontes and Steropes, and stubborn-hearted Argus, who gave Zeus the thunder and made the thunderbolt. In all else, they were like the gods, but one eye only was set in the midst of their foreheads. Okay. What a different spelling of Cyclops. Uh, hello, Brontes. Uh, you you are a very brave woman down there. Also, probably a very dead one soon enough. Yep. 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 And okay, he destroys the cracked ones. Okay, but if there is one thing we know about Cyclopses and such. Is that that one eye? Eye? Yeah, also makes for a big vulnerability. Wait, you did hit it? I thought you missed. Oh, and the floor is regenerated, it seems. Oh, oh, it looks like the eye is the only thing we can hit. Yes, I was. <laughs> His shins are obviously not getting any damage. Maybe higher up? Yep, only the eye. Do, I did hear a squish out of you. Stabbed his butt. Hmm. And maybe only certain parts are vulnerable. Okay, he's not being blinded anymore. Well, he's probably actually blind now. Good thing that we got the bo Artemis' bow for this, huh? so we can reload faster. If he actually ducked underneath that one. Okay. One more. Yep. One more hit. There we go. <laughs> okay, now we are both a god and Cyclops Slayer. Okay. Hunting arrows. Anything in there? Some health things. Okay. Give me those. Ow. <laughs> okay, being on fire makes us rave for a bit, it seems. Okay. Now, my friend, uh, there you are. You're alive. I escaped in the confusion you made, but we're not out of the woods yet. And we're not even in the woods. If you seek to defeat Apollo, there are ways to tilt the scales. Find the nymph Daphne in Apollo's garden. She carries a deep hatred and will help you more than I can. The fiery stallions that pull the solar chariot must be unfettered. Apollo will be weakened without his blazing war machine. Finally, Apollo's trusted lieutenants will guard him with their lives. Put an end to them before they can make such a selfless sacrifice. Go, 
Free my precious son from that villain's grasp. And that's the stream timer. So let's see. Yeah, save. Okay. Well, we'll have to uh, kill the sun next time then. <laughs> oh okay. dear. Yeah, this game is going to be quite something since we're literally out to kill the gods. We're basically Kratos if he was flattened down to 2D. Yeah, no, I, I think it's just killing us, defeating them. Uh, I'm pretty sure For Artemis is plenty dead. Yeah, but I'm sure if any gods actually were ever slain in the mythology. Hmm. I'd have to double check on that, but for now, before we end the stream, let's go look for someone to raid. Yeah. So, right. change the screen Usually share. Usually a god can kill another god, but a mortal cannot. Usually. Okay. There's a lot of people online, so I think I'll have to narrow it down a bit. Uh, Jim McGinger is playing something other than cross uh, code for once. They're playing Pyre. Uh, oh. I'm nice is always playing Animal Crossing. Uh, oh, hello. Nico Silverado is playing Vulcanoids. And then we have Jackson Sam, who is playing Dave the Diver. Any of those are interesting? Or shall I take a pick? Uh, let me take a pick. Let's go visit Nico then. We visited them somewhat recently, but when they were doing an art stream. So let's rate them while they're actually doing a game stream this time. Yeah. I'm also curious if they've updated that game any much. Okay, uh, copy name, then head to, our, head to our place. Okay, slash raid, paste. But before we start, before we go off there, I, let's see any of our typical, <laughs> any of our typical lurkers. No, but I do see pizza in there. So hi, pizza lover. Hello, pizza. <laughs> So, yeah, thank you, and thank you as always, Drakir. You're welcome as always, my friend, and thank you all for joining. And, yeah, if nothing gets in the way, then tomorrow yeah, we'll have ourselves a Left 4 Dead stream with Ram and Liz. Again, if nothing gets in the way. And uh, then on Tuesday, for, for as good as sure, we will be continuing with Sonic Adventure. Yay! But for now, thank you all again for watching, and uh, thank you all for watching an hour or later. And until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe for a while, and watch out for undead seagulls. And so let me actually start the <laughs>